Yo, 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 everyone. What's going on? What is happening? We have another crab's treasure today. It's a Souls-like cute crab game. It came out a week ago from recording, April 25th. It's the 2nd of May right now, so it came out about a week ago from this recording. Uh, it's very positive on Steam, and then you just get to go on a cute treasure hunt. I was kind of craving another Souls-like game. So here we are. We're going to jump right on in. I believe they recommend controller for this game. I don't even know if you can use mouse and key. So we'll stick with the controller and let's get right into it. What word comes to mind when you think of the earth? For some, that word might be beautiful. Others might say the world is hateful or evil, or unstable, or full of shit. But above all else, the word that best describes our world is resilient. Against the odds, time and time again, creatures adapt to make the most of their given environment. Some learn to feed on others, stealing their vitality for their own. Some become scavengers, living off what strangers leave behind. And others still, as we will soon see, would prefer to be simply left alone. Please open up. Oh, uh, you're not a bird. Sir, are you the owner of this residence? You mean my shell? Uh, yeah, it's mine. Do you like it? I represent the Royal Duchy of Slacktide, which has recently annexed the territory surrounding and including this tide pool. I'm here to inform you that you have outstanding taxes that date back at upwards of 10 tides. If you are presently unable to pay this balance, the duchy will claim your home until you- uh, Hold on, uh, I've got some questions. First of all, uh, what's a duchy? Also, taxes? Okay, so basically, the Duchess of Slack Tide owns this whole area now. And she puts a lot of effort into keeping it safe. So, everyone who benefits from that has to abide by her rules and pay up once per tide. There's still plenty of birds here. I don't know if it's really safe. Look, kid, I don't have time to argue political nuances here. I've got a lot of tax evaders to get to. You gotta pay up right now, or I'm gonna have to repo your property. Got it? Okay, okay, I think I've got a hard kelp or two around here somewhere. <laughs> All right. Let's pay up then. Oh, wait, hold on. It kind of looks like we can use mouse and key. Do I want to do that? Or do I want to see what controller? Um, let's try mouse and key. I'd rather play like that. We'll leave the controller plugged in. But yeah, let's do this. Okay. Where'd he go? Move our little legs. Hello, Mr. Lone Shark. I don't know about you guys, but the, the ocean is i mean that's one of my fears biggest fears being trapped out there i'm gonna wait till the tide comes in kid do to enter hurry up and find something to pay me with or i'm gonna start getting serious all right we gotta find something to pay him uh what do we have here anything no okay not too sure what that's doing Oh, we're like hiding in our shell. There we go. Found your stash of heart kelp. Everyone loves these delicious heart kelps. My phone just fell. Oh, heart kelp pods. So they're often used for trading. Eating just one of these makes you feel restored. Okay. So that is how we get health, huh? Hopefully this is enough for taxes. Let's hope. Hey, I know this isn't much, but... What the shell is this? They're heart kelp pods. Don't tell me you don't even like heart kelp. 
I hope you're joke. I hope you're joking. No one uses these dumb things as money anymore. The ocean's moved to trash. Standard now. Trash. You got it? Trash? So, like, no pearls either? No shiny pirate coins? That's right. None of that crap. So you better find some bread clips or some sauce packets back there. I'm losing my darn patience. Look, if... If you just give me a couple more types. Alright, I've had enough. Say goodbye to your shell, idiot. Oh, damn. Wait, wait. Bro, really just stole my shell? Shameless. Absolutely shameless right there. Oh, crab, crab, crab. But we got no shell. Oh, this is our... This is us hiding in our shell now. We don't have one to hide in. Oh, he's over there. Can we go get it? Let's jump that. Oh, we can sprint. Okay. Where'd he go? Come here. Give me my shell back. Give me my shell back. You can't do this to me, man. How am I supposed to stay safe from all the birds and stuff around here? Not my problem. You want your shell back? You better go get a job and pay up. I hear they're always hiring in the reef. The reef? Isn't it super busy there? I don't want to talk to people. Again, really not my problem. I don't care where you get the trash from, but I'm keeping this until you do. See you later. Oh. Crab, 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 crab. No way. I think we gotta jump in then. We gotta get our shell back, everyone. That's crazy. You just took our shell. What would I be if I were in the ocean? Let's think. I think I'd want to be a turtle. I think I'd want to be a turtle. Absolutely would want to be a turtle. Yeah. A little scavenger. Oh, yeah. I definitely want to be a little scavenger turtle. Want to see? Okay. What I don't know is how to eat the krill if I take damage, right? I kind of want to figure that out. Will it tell me anywhere? Uh, no shell equip stowaways. Equip a stowaway to enhance your abilities and then adaptations, okay. How do I pull up the main menu, though? Um, I'm not too sure. Hopefully it'll just tell me how to eat that when, when the time comes. Hold space while jumping. Swim. Oh, nice. Oh, okay, shit. This game is super cool. Ready for some combat, though. Let's see that combat. Alright, it didn't look like... I mean, we are underwater, so... I would imagine not much fall damage, right? If any. Um, let's climb up here, maybe. Can I get up there? No. Oh, hey, it's another crab. Excuse me, sir. Uh, did you see a really tall shark pass by carrying a super awesome dope-looking shell? Whoa, whoa. Work? What's that? I'm not trying... I'm trying to not do... Well, that's what I'm trying not to do. I don't know why. I need to get into the reading game here. It's late. That's why I gotta catch up with... Worthless. Holy crap, what's wrong with your eyes? Have you been sleeping enough or... Oh god, get away from me. Oh wait. Oh, there's, there's multiple of them. Oh, we gotta run. I don't even know if we can, like, fight. Um, let's just stay away from all these... What is this? A little starfish? The only thing I can do is like... That. Oh. Shit. Okay, we have a little dodge. Oh, my controller's gonna keep rumbling and that's probably annoying to hear. I'm gonna unplug it. We don't want that rumbling on the desk here. Sheesh, I thought I lost them. I knew the ocean could be sketchy, but I had no idea it was this bad. The crabs were not friendly. 
will be here, Fork. I guess it couldn't hurt to have a way to defend myself. This thing seems like it could do a little damage. If anyone else attacked me, I guess I'll poke him with the pokey bit. Might as well give this bad boy a few practice swings. Oh yeah, might as well give this bad boy a few practice swings. Found a rusty fork. Press M1 to swing the fork. Acknowledge. Okay, so we have just like basic attack and then charge attack. Okay. With a little lunge on it too. Alright. Bet. Wait, can I get up there? No. Can I? I want to get into the settings. I'm just not too sure how to get there. But what I just hit. How would I do that? Oh, these little arrows up here. Okay. All right, here we go. Settings. Controls. Rewind. Oh, okay, we do have some mouse and key controls here. Here we go. Let's see. Space, left shift, jump. Tap. C to sprint. We'll just hold shift to sprint though. All right, heal is R. Okay, I'm just, get, can I make this just like mouse button? No, cancel. We'll leave it R, that's fine. Grapples F, left control to shell spell. Q is adaptation. Swap the adaptation, swap to hammer. Okay, what about eating? I'm not too sure how we eat. Oh, heal. That's right. Why, why? I was being dumb. Okay, good on that then. Um, I don't know if this will affect my mouse. I doubt it. Oh, it actually did. Oh, it did affect it. Okay. Um, that's a little too much. But we can just go down. I'll say 50 is probably good. Yep, that'll do. Focusing on enemies. Press middle mouse to focus on enemies, keeping the camera locked to them. This is really useful for fighting, so don't forget about it. Yes, that is. Charge attack. Got him. That wasn't too bad. Did he drop any loot? Doesn't look like it. Let's go find our shell. Dodging attacks. Tap shift right as the enemy attacks to dodge out of the way. The timing takes some practice, but dodging successfully can avoid most damage. Okay. Alright. Nice. Those are some good dodges. Right on. What else we got going on? Be interesting. Do we have stamina? I don't think we do. Let's see, can I just dodge infinitely? I don't see a stamina bar, so I think we can. Wondering if like weapons and stuff are in these bottles at all. I guess they are uh, translucent, so we should be able to see that, right? Oh, there is that. Okay, we can attack. We can attack in the air. Let's hit this. Could be good. Three crystals. We have seventy-five something else. Not sure what that currency is. Right. Whoa, what's that thing? The currents start getting warm close to this little platform. It's kind of comfy. Maybe I could rest my feet here for a little while. Okay, so this is like a bonfire. The ocean version. Moon snail shell found. Ooh. Touch these glowing currents to restore a long forgotten moon snail shell which you can rest in to restore your health. If you're slain, you'll revive at the last one you stayed at, so be sure to activate every one you can. Absolutely. Uh, 
Um, level up. Shell collection. Exit. Let's level up. Is that what these symbols are down here? 75? Microplastics and leveling up. The power present in moon snail shells will allow you to purge microplastics from yourself, gaining strength in the process. However, certain folks might be interested in trading for your extra microplastics, so you might want to consider saving them. Okay, so they're like the souls, right? Got it. All right, level up. We have 75 of them. Next level costs 300. All right, so we can't do anything right now. We need uh, 225. Got it. Home. No building. 69 shells. Huh. 69 shells, you say? All right, then. Let's go find one. Looks like there's abilities attached to the shells, too. There you are. Wow, you're awful pers you're awful persistent. I think I've been pretty clear with you, kid. This shell's the property of the Duchess now. If you want it back, take it up with her, not me. My work is done here. Come on, man. There's gotta be something I can do. Yeah, now that you mention it, I can think of something. You can lick my freaking ventral fins and stop bothering me. Ouch. Damn. This dude is shameless. Baha, later, kid. Uh, this guy. For real? This dude, wait, what is this? Nothing, okay. The shallows. What are going on? Can we talk to the snail? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't you, don't see your type leaving the tide pool too often. Yeah, well, I didn't have a choice. Can you tell me what's going on here? I heard that there's like a duchess in charge now. Yep, sure is. Real piece of work. Takes all my hard-earned microplastics every tide just for existing around here. And what do I see for it? Nothing. Just keeps building up her castle and hiring more soldiers to defend it. Oh, that's cool. Where can I find her? I think she has something in mind. Pal, just look around for a moment and you'll probably figure it out. Or did you miss that huge castle in the distance? Okay, great. I'll head over there. Hopefully she can get rid of my taxes for me. Oh, I see how it is. You're some kind of freeloader, are you? Wait, you think you can skirt your taxes while the rest of us keep this society together, do you? You just said... You hermit crabs are all the same. Wearing the shells the rest of us worked so hard to create with our own mantles. You ought to have stayed in your tide pool, small fry. Hey, I never did anything to you, man. Yeah, well... How's about I do something to you? Wait, for real? Hey, no. Yeah, I mean, I they, they tried to attack me, guys. Why does everyone in this place try to kill me? This shell doesn't even fit. All right, calm down, Krill. This is the most dangerous situation you've been in since seagull breeding season. And all you gotta do is make it to the castle, like the rude snail said. Sounds like that duchess controls the taxes around here, so I bet the shark took my shell to her. I'm sure once I tell her what's going on, this can all be resolved, and I can go right back to sleep. Uh, yeah. I'm sure that is the case, Krill. I am certain that the duchess will be that forgiving. And there'll be no problem. Okay. Oh, we got a little crab here. We got our hit. That, okay, we actually can they even get a hit off if I just now look at that All right, what about what about this fish over here? I see that dude at the top Get a little flip-flop All right, they do like a little charge attack I'll just keep staggering them though. There we go Get the sleep A bread claw or breed claw? I'm not too sure. A small chunk of plastic in the shape of a crab's claw. Maybe it has some value. Trade it in for is that 250 microplastics. All right. That's a good amount of microplastics. 
That's some good money. Is that loot in this bottle? Something shiny in there, right? Or is that this from the sunlight? I think that was from the sunlight. Come on. Nice. Okay, they do drop loot sometimes. Look at that. A barbed hook. A weapon designed to reel and prey at long distance. In combination with a sturdy piece of string, even massive targets might be drawn in if struck at a weak point. All right, I'm curious as to what kind of weapons and builds we can go with in this game. What are we thinking? I'm thinking, I'm thinking maybe range. If we can do that, maybe the hook will allow us to do that. Let's get that loot at the top of this. The more loot up there. Now. A blood star limb, a severed limb of a blood star, easily regenerated by the host creature. Collect four more to increase vitality. Okay. We'll do. Keep staggering him, no problem. Oh, he's big, he's big. Gotta heal. Oh man, we got a lot of enemies on us. Okay. Let's hit him and roll. Oh, he's gonna crush. We're good, we kill him here. He's dead. These little ones get staggered. No problem. Okay, we got a, we got a little cleave with this fork too. That's nice. All right. We just have a. Uh, and what what is this fish? I don't know. Somebody let me know what kind of fish this is. No. I'm missing a few. No problem with that one. All right. Anything else up and over here? It looks like a, another shell up here that we can activate though. Let's harvest that. Wait, did we grab it? Okay, so we have to harvest it and then grab it. Got it. Nice. Let's activate this. Let's enter. We have enough to level up. I didn't look. We do. 312. Okay. Um, how many points do we get? Okay, looks like every level we just get one point. So we have vitality, increase the amount of health. We have um assuming this is like it's shell damage prevention. Decrease the damage your shell takes and improves resistance to status effects. Okay, so it's like a, a resistance thing. Enhances attack damage. Enhances damage of... Uh, what is that? I, I don't know that word. Mommy? What? <clears throat> that didn't sound right. I think we just go with attack damage. Yeah. Confirm. To gain plus one attack. Yes. Yahoo! Confirm. I think we might just go... Wait, is this like magic though? That might be like the magic in the game. Shoot. I can't go back on it now though. Um, uh, okay. That's fine. That's only one point. I feel like that that could be the magic. The umami. Whatever it is. Keep our eyes peeled for the good loot. So far we have no shell. Only a, a rusty fork. And some guards. Halt, trespasser. I'm not even in there yet. I'm not trespassing. 
By order of the Duchess, all suspicious characters are to be barred from slack tight. Suspicious? I thought I looked pretty harmless. Downright adorable, huggable even. Perhaps you speak it truth, vagrant, but I shall near grant grantest thou entry twixt these mighty gates whilst thy loins remain ungirded. Ex shucking excuse me? Dude, take a hint. She's saying you're naked. Oh, yeah. I guess I hadn't thought about that. Is that important these days? I feel like society's really moved on without me while I've been practicing self-care. Sure seems like it. The Duchess would have our heads if we let you in wearing nothing but a rag. Fret not, little crustacine. Nearby to the east lieth a repository laden with complimentary garmentry. Face the gate and turn right, and you'll find a charity center where you can get something to wear. Our captain is stationed there right now, I think. Great guy. He'll get you sorted. Sounds cool. And then you'll let me in? Assuming nothing sketchy comes up in your background check, sure. Alright. Well, let's go get an outfit, everyone. After we collect this loot and kill this fishy... I'm very curious how these boss battles are going to go. Alright. Can we just get a charge on this guy? Here, pull this. Okay. Mr. Robot, that does one shot him. Another bard hook. Just kill you. You guarding the loot back here? Oh, there's that up there. Can I get up there, though? I don't think I can. Yeah, I don't think we can get up there. Um, uh, maybe we can jump from here, actually. Hold on now. No. Shoot, okay. Maybe from up top there somehow. Yeah, we can get up there somehow because there's a crystal. What is this? Oh, we just broke a bottle. That's all that was. Oh, we can climb up there. Great. Let's go up there. Let's get that loot. Some more crystals. Six of them now. Still unsure. I'll see if there's like a drop attack that doesn't seem to be on. We can attack in there though. Some more health. Give it to me. Why can't I grab it? I'm just gonna let it land. Why is it running for me? Give it to me. Why can't I grab this? Uh, oh, maybe I can. Maybe I can only hold three. Maybe I can only hold three. That's probably the case. Let's uh, let's check again, right? Yeah, I can only hold three. Little parkour. Okay, we we'll go over here. Well, oh, maybe. Hold on. Um, I don't know where we go from there. Do we get... Let's break this. This seems like something, right? Oh, no. It's just a water bottle. All right, then. Where is this dude that can give me something nice to wear? Is it in here? Let your dreams fizzle. The vending machine. Push button. What we just do? Wear shell. So okay. We oh okay. So we can pick out a soda can here. Um, defense thirty. 
Are they all the same? Or are they any different? Like the only difference is the look. Yeah. What color can do we want? Oh, uh, this one looks nice. Phew, now I can get in to see the Duchess. This shell, this shell chased like heck compared to mine. Who even made this thing? Found a weird metal shell. Press and hold the mouse to, to hide inside your shell. Wearing a shell reduces damage taken. Hiding in it will divert all damage to your shell health. I see. So that's the blue bar. Oh crab, I'm uh -oh. sorry. Was I supposed to grab a ticket? You think yourself above the law, but the law is not so easily outwitted. By its strength alone, do we rise above the beasts? Uh, I'm really sorry. I'll go to the back of the line, okay? <laughs> you should be so lucky. I'll have your head like I have these other worthless law breakers. Let's do it, Krill. First boss fight, Nefro, Captain of the Guard. Okay. We do have, like... Oh, he just straight up goes through barricades. You gonna swing? Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, so he does, like, a little back kick. Well, okay, that back kick is really getting us. We gotta walk. Maybe I can... No, my shell did take some damage from that. We need to get him to maybe hit something, right? I thought I dodged that shit. Oh, shit. Ow. Okay. We use the shell to take damage there. No, I rolled it. You damn your filthy soul. Damn. Destined for the drain. Okay. Would you like to respond at the nearby moon jelly location? Yes. Let's go kill this dude. You died when you were slain. You'll drop all your microplastics and your shell if you had one in the spot where you died. Be careful when you get to pick them up. If you die again while they're still on the ground, they'll be lost forever. Okay, it's just spawning me here. Junk recovered. I got my junk. What about my shell, though? Oh, I did the button again. Okay, that's kind of nice. So it seems like in boss fights, you just spawn back at the boss fight, or maybe just this one. We'll find out. Okay, we can kind of cheese this a little bit. We can grab all these other ones when we run out of HP on this one. Can I skip? Yeah. Alright, let's get him. Where's he at? Oh, there you are. Come here. Hit us. Let's get him right here. Okay, ow. Alright, nice. We use our shell there. Use our shell again. Unblockable attacks. Some attacks are unblockable aggro attacks, signaled by the aggro symbol that appears above Krill. Um, that symbol? Okay. When you see it, be sure to dodge, run, or jump out of the way. Got it. Oh, right. Right there. I, uh... I misunderstood what it was saying. I was looking above the boss for that symbol to let me know that he was going to do that. It is above my character because my character's name is Krill and it did tell me that. 
That's okay. We can do it this time, though. We dodge that. We just, as long as we don't get grabbed, he's dead there. Oh, oops, sorry. There we go. Let's go. He's done this time. He's done this time. Here we go. I'm gonna bring the battle to him. We're going in. Oh, all right. All right, I'm just trying to eat real quick. Come here. Come here. Out. Roll. I couldn't roll. I was stuck. I couldn't roll. I don't know why I can roll right there. Was I stuck on his leg? I think I was stuck on his leg. Had to have been. Darn. Can skip that too. All right, let's get him. Let's do it. Trying to run behind me. Balance and capsize. Hitting an enemy with enough attacks to max out their balance meter will open them up to being capsized. When their health bar starts, so basically staggered, when their health bar starts flashing, hit them with a powerful attack, such as charge attack, to knock them down for several seconds. Okay, he's flashing right now. Okay, we knocked him down. Big damage, big damage. We get him here. Yes. You can't. Got him. Run the law forever, kid. Pollution. What did that say? I, I wasn't looking there. That was self-defense, right? Yeah, it absolutely was. That's got to be self-defense. Anyone would agree. He came at me like crazy, guy. What was I supposed to do? Shuck, shuck, shuck. Okay, play it cool. If anyone asks, he's just tripped and broke his leg and landed on a sword. Yeah, tripped. Oh man, we got a lot of uh, a lot of trash from that guy too. Do a little level up here. Actually, before we do that though, boom, boom, boom. Let's be smart. Let's swap out our shell because that one's pretty banged up. All right. <laughs> Get a little shell spot here, too. Nice little snail shell. Let's enter. Level up. All right. Is this magic? I guess I don't have to level up right now. I, I think it is like this style of magic. Maybe. So I'm going to hold off on doing upgrades. I do have a lot to spend, though. I do have a lot to spend. That's right. I'm sure we'll find an item soon that will uh, have that on it. Let's go get in the castle now that we have a shell. Come here. Okay. Let's go up here. Let's take out this fishy. This fork's pretty nice, though. The fork's not too bad right now. Seems to be doing pretty good damage. What is this? Is this another shell? Okay, so it's it's a lightweight, but it's got lower defense. Look at us. 
I'm gonna go with this shell there. Um, all right, let's see if we can go in here now. You return, exhibitionist. And draped appro appropriately, no less. I trust you spoke with the captain. The captain? Funny, I uh, must have missed him. Missed him, huh? That's pretty weird. Whatever. You're not nude anymore, so that's what counts. Hark, you weary a vagabond doth grace our gates. Pray I... Would see them part four. I can't read like this. Open the gates, Nate. You got it. Hey, I feel like there's an awful lot of violence around here. I thought the whole point of the Duchess was to make things safe. Go tell her all about it, kid. See how quickly you can get kicked back to your tide pool. I will go tell her all about it. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna go kill that Duchess. What I'm gonna do. You look like you have something nice to say. Do some jumping jacks. The captain takes his job very seriously and expects the same for all of us. This is Slack Tide Footman. We've been doing drills non-stop since high tide. You're doing your drills, man. You're doing a great job. Same thing here. The sculptures around here can be hit or miss, but I kind of dig this one. Uh -huh, get it? You get it? Because it's a shovel digging? I get it. I'm just gonna skip all you guys. Hey, where do you think you're going, chum? I'm gonna go see the Duchess lady. Oh yeah, just gonna walk in and see du the Duchess, huh? What do you think we're all standing around for, a tour? Come back when you made an appointment like the rest of. Actually, due to a gap in her schedule, our Royal Duchess is receiving walk-ins for the next 15 minutes. Wait, oh neat, I'll head on in then. Oh, ow. That was an accident. I did not see that pokey thing. All right, Duchess. Can I have my, my home back? My other shell. Speak. Oh, uh, yes, ma'am. I uh, recently had my shell taken away. And I was wondering if there's any way we could work out some sort of a... Do you like my castle, little hermit? Your castle? Oh, um, it's pretty neat, I guess. You guess? Why would he say it like that? A lot of work went into this place, you know? Come on, Krill. Work made possible by generous contributions from citizens like yourself. And it was worth it, don't you think? Oh yeah, uh, definitely. Look, I can find another way to pay my taxes, but for now I'd really just like to... Even more gorgeous than the coral reefs, wouldn't you say? I've never been to... I mean, yeah, absolutely. The reefs are super overrated. Uh, everyone says so. She's oh, catching on. Perhaps we can work out a deal, little hermit. But first, I'll need something from you. My castle still lacks a certain... panache, pizzazz, flair, je ne sais quoi. A platoon went out on my behalf to recover something shiny and gorgeous from the cave to the west. But those buffoons haven't reported in since. Such incompetence. Climb the Western Tower to begin your journey to the cave. Then catch up with my platoon and help recover something worthy of my beauty. Return to me with Trinket in Claw, and we can speak of delaying your tax payments for no longer than two calendar tides. Okay, thank you. I won't let you down. I'll get you the shiniest thing I can. Oh yeah, I also wanted to mention the crazy murderous crabs outside trying to- Be gone, little hermit. I tire of you. Uh, yes, ma'am. All right, let's go get her shiny object so that we can get our shell back. All right, cave to the west, which is this way. 
Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and actually have this E. Oh, can I actually not get in these? Wait, harvest. There we go. Give me. All right, it looks like yeah, we can we can only hold three. That is why we're having issues before. What's over here? I don't know what you think you'll find up here, but you ain't gonna get a, the chance, small fry. All right, sorry. I mean, uh, I I turned too early. I don't wanna. I mean, I have almost a thousand junk, like trash. I don't want to hold on to that much just in case shit starts getting dangerous, you know? Do I just put points in the purple category and just hope for the best that it's like the magic kind of one? Hey, can I get by here? Does it look like it? A shipment of the fort's defensive urchins got spilled out across the hall. It's really got the Duchess up in arms. She's actually executed five people over it. Damn. Whoa. Well, I really got to get by here. Duchess orders. Duchess orders, huh? All right, tell you what. I think there's some leftover gear in the room across the hall that could help you get into this tower. Just don't go blaming me if you get yourself hurt. Okay, thank you. Okay, cool. We can go get some gear. All right, maybe here we'll figure out what the purple does. Um, It's over here, right? Yeah. All right, I guess I can let you in if you're on a Duchess approved mission. I really didn't want to see that. I really didn't want you to see the mess back here. Just find what you need and skedaddle, okay? And please don't tell anyone. I'll have it cleaned up soon, promise. Sure you will. Sure. All right, what can we find? What can we find? Where's some stuff? We have to do some parkour. Parkour, it seems, all right. Can I not make that? There we go. Uh, right here. See what this guy has to say. Oh, he's that it's the same guy. He's back. He's up here. This room was supposed to be cleaned up like two tides ago. First the urchin spill blocking the west tower, and now this. No way I'll be able I'll be able to meet up with my platoon in time. I really wanted to impress the Duchess. All right, man. Do we make that jump? Oh, we do. Perfect. And then from here, what do we got? There's loot all the way up there. Also loot down there. We probably want to go for the one up highest first, right? So how do we get to that? Hmm. Maybe this bottle. Okay, we can't get on the bottle. Fishing line. Found some old string. Hold F to aim at a fish hook. Then release to grapple towards it. Oh, that's how. Nice. We have a grappling hook now. All right, cool. Release. Grapple up. Okay. Can we actually get over to the... Oh, let's just do this. I bet we can reach it from over here. Yes, we can. A sea star. The legends say that these can grant any wish. They're wrong though. Plus three vitality. Stowaways, you just found your first stowaway, a little friend that you can equip in the status menu to gain all sorts of benefits. Okay, so this is like the jewelry, like, like rings or amulets or whatnot from other games. But their bonuses only apply while you're wearing a shell. Don't take them for granted. Okay, well, we are wearing a shell. 
Can we put it on? This is a plus three vitality. Let's take it. Okay. No adaptations yet. I really want to know what what this it does damage so it does something right we are maybe we'll just increase our vitality the next uh next chance we get to upgrade huh that way we got point i mean it's always good to have vitality can never go wrong with that choice i think that was a lot of loot Oh, there's these crystals, though. I still don't know what these are used for. Still unsure about those. But I think we're good to head on out. Head towards the West Tower. See if we can find the lost platoon. Talk to him. I think there's some leftover gear in there. Oh, wait. We did that. Sweet. We are now up here. It's a nice little castle. Oh. We can get that. And then we can get that. Very nice. Rusty nail. A sharp corroded. This is a, okay. This is a stowaway. Plus four attack. Minus three MSG. What is what is MSG? I don't know. Um, three res required to to wear this though. Okay, so we cannot equip that then. Wait, did we? Oh, wait, we did. Why does it say three res required, but we equipped it? Plus four attack. Did we get plus four attack? Let's see. I don't. I don't. I don't think it even worked. No, it did. Wait, no, it didn't. I was looking at the wrong stat. We have sixteen attack right here. This is supposed to give us plus four, and it does not because we'd be at 20, so. It does not work. Because of the res requirement. All right, can I just, what do you guys think? Can we just go here and then, oh no, that's not gonna work. Okay, ow. Ow, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not going to be able to get those. I didn't mean to fall, man. I was trying to grapple back up so I could just swim over there. Shoot. All right, let's go grab the shell, see if we can get our stuff back. Oh, there is no more shell over here. Darn, okay. We gotta be careful, we can't die. Honestly, safest way, we just climb up right here and get some good distance. Get this shell down here. All right. Now I have a question. Oh, they're really chasing me. Oh, that was a weird camera. Alright, what I wanted to check was... Are my stowaways still on here? Okay, they are. Alright, let's go up here. I feel like I'm zoomed in more. Am I? Did I do something? I do something? Is there like a zoom? Shell spell. I bet that's what that MSG or whatever is. Um.
Mouse wheel down. Swap focus left. That's, I think that's what I did. Mouse wheel up. I didn't seem to do anything. Okay. Did it always look like this? I feel like I'm like super zoomed in. There we go. Now it's fixed. I just had to like cast that fishing line. All right, can I get my stuff without taking too much damage? I think if I just like... Oh no, they pulled me in. Okay, Whew. let's see, we got it all back and that's what matters. Now, can I safely, can I just roll through? We can, okay. All right, what to do against this rolling boulder? Can we, I think we can just like tuck in here. Yeah. And then wait out one more. Or is there just one? I think there's just one. Oh, Shell, are you okay? I can't believe I dropped it. I'm so stupid. I had one job and it was to hold that urchin in place until the captain comes back. Now that I think about it, he might have been joking around. Classic Captain Nefro, a golden smile and the joyful heart of a prankster. Anyway, sorry I almost killed you there. Hmm, too bad for this guy, his uh, his captain friend has been slain by us. This guy's everywhere. Some loot, ooh, gimme, give gimme. Give Barnacle, an immobile anthropod with a tough shell often found attached to larger structures. Okay, that's a, that's a nice stowaway right there. That is a nice one. Can I, can I not go on this? Wait, why is it? Oh, did it cost, wait, is, oh, it's cause they cost, okay, they cost a certain amount. Um, do we want the three vitality or the extra 10 defense? Honestly, we probably want the extra two or the extra 10 defense. Hey, I'm impressed. I didn't think anyone could make it up here with all those urchins spilled everywhere. Thanks. Still new to grappling around, but I'm getting the hang of it. Could you do me a favor then? Some mates of mine went to survey the moon caves some time ago, and no one's seen them since. If you're heading up this way to the caves, could you keep an eye out for them? Absolutely, I will. After I take this drink. All right, keep our eye out for him. Can we grab this? Bottle cap. Um, I think medium's fine. Eat a drop. Oh, a shortcut. That's a helpful shortcut. Go here and climb right up. I don't see any loot that way, let's run this way. We do have a grappling thing here. Let's hit it. Go, go, go. Were we taking poison damage? I think we were right there. Okay, he does a little double attack. Forgot about that one. Oh, it's that stuff that does the uh, poison damage. Oh, a tin can. And it gives us one resilience, huh? Let's take a look at that. That's nice. 
Yeah, it did. Now we have one. We need we need three for this to work though. What is this? Why is this highlighted? I don't know what that did. Can I like sneak attack? No. How? Should we get him right there? That was almost really bad. We need to spend these. Oh, okay. Perfect. We have snail shell station. In an effort to recover this home, a plucky hermit crab ventures into a mysterious cave. But he quickly discovers that the return journey will be significantly more challenging. Hello? Who's talking? He approaches the ghosty, ghostly figure in front of him. I'll approach just a second. I'm gonna level up real quick. Alright, let's level up. Alright, we're gonna take a gamble. Let's put everything into this. At least two points. Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure what that will do, but let's hope it does something cool. Um, let's go here. Let's talk to him. Hi, uh, my name's Krill. Do you know of anything shiny in this kit? Something that might impress like a huge, beautiful crab leaf. Confused and desperate, the hermit crab begins begging help from strangers. Hey, I'm not desperate. Yet, thus far, he has preserved... Preserved by taking refuge in artifacts from beyond the waves. But to survive from here on out, he must awaken the currents inside of him. He must access the power of Umami. Okay, here's what we're going to figure out. Uh, the, I think it's like some, some kind of magic, like rune ability or something. Umami, hopefully I'm saying that right. Look, if there's some secret I should know about, can you please just tell me what it is? Suspect so convoluted enough ever since I left the tide pool. Feeling pity for the helpless creature, the noble moon snail designs to awaken his latent abilities manually. You better not be messing with <gasps> Oh shit, we just got hit by something. Whoa, what the shell was that? I feel tingly. Hermit crab does duns a mental shell and feels a new ability awaken. I do? Yes, he does. All right, here we go. Umami training. Shell spells. While wearing a shell, press control to consume umami charges and activate its unique shell spell. Used umami charges will regenerate slowly when you attack enemies with your fork. Okay. Easy enough to understand. Okay, I see we have like three, the three like umami dots over there right above our shell defense. Okay. Control while wearing a shell, shell spell. Okay, so this has, what I'm wearing has shell shock and that has fizzle. What does shell shock do? Let's see. Okay. Not too a creature blocks the hermit crab's path. Immune to its physical attacks, it may only be dispatched by his newfound umami power powers. Well, isn't that convenient? The noble moon snail denies any involvement in manufacturing this scenario. I see. I see. Okay. The once innocent hermit crab's ability to slaughter his enemies has increased dramatically. Do you have to put it that put it that way? He senses that the reward he seeks lies further within this cavern, as well as the opportunity to meet his newfound idol, the mysterious and attractive moon snail in the flesh. Guess I've got no choice. Guess we have no choice. Okay, so these are like little charging stations. Stations. What is this one then? Fizzle. Okay, that's like uh. 
like a get a, get away from me type deal. I kind of like that. I like that. Let's stick with this one. Um, what about this one? The bottle cap. Pop off. Let's check it. Ooh. That one's not terrible. I think I'm gonna stick with this one. Can I get back to that charging station though? Oh wait, we're fully charged on it. Oh wait. Oh yeah, that was it, okay. There we go. Did we get everything over here? Yeah. All right, we can grapple over to that. That's some loot. Red claw. Oh, that's big damage. Oh, shit. It's the same thing, you pop off. However, it does have more uh, hit points on it. Let's keep venturing through this cavern. What do we think happened to the... Uh, the crew's definitely dead, right? I mean, they're definitely dead. Missed time that. Oh no, we missed that. Ow. Oh no. Shit. That is not what we wanted to happen. Alright, so we get our stuff back. Grab this for the time being. Um, okay, yeah, let's do this. Honestly, this one's this looks pretty good, too. Oh, no. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We're gonna die. We just lost all of our junk. Did we? Wait, spawn us back here. Maybe we didn't. I didn't mean for that to happen. It was just a little awkward. Off the jump there. Um, I do think... Wait, no. It wasn't this one where the problem was. Oh, and the bubbles do damage. That's nice. We just gotta be kind of careful with it, because we don't want to, like, knock ourselves off the edge. Okay. We, the, actually, the fall did not ruin our junk. We can quickly go grab it. Can I... Ow. No way, man. There we go. We're doing all right. Hit him. He's dead. Okay. Whew. That is kind of crazy. We're out of health as well. All right. Let's go this way. We can drop the shortcut. There we go. Shortcut. We need to find some health, though. Those guys are pretty tough, not gonna lie. Alright, no drop attack. This is not good. We're just gonna leave them. That was getting risky. This tiny snail adheres to rocks. Okay, stow away. Plus two res. Okay. Uh, 
Okay. Um, did that one just cost one? It does. So let's put it on. We kind of need to get to food, though. Otherwise, we're kind of screwed. Um, if we get hit once, we're dead. We're just going to skip. Where's some food? We need food, man. Oh, uh, no food up there. We're not going to pull that guy. No food anywhere. Can't find any. Oh, there's some though. Right, let's go for it. Oh, come on, get us there. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. We're gonna be able to get that back. I don't know, guys. Let's go with this one. Actually, do we have that middle one? I don't think we do. All right. Oh, we do have the shortcut now, so that is nice. We should be able to get back there, no problem. Okay, it auto drops, that's good. All right. Can you back over to that guy so we can grab? Our trash. Right over here. Okay, all right, ow. Oh, he's dead. Got him. Got him, any good loot? Oh my goodness, this is a big shell. Munch. Wait. Oh no, it's a bit, it's a banana. It's a banana peel. Uh, what does Munch do? I kind of want to test it out. Oh, it's just... Big AoE attack, it looked like. But the shell just goes away. Alright. Party time. And it, it gives us, uh... The MSG up too. Let's check it out. We'll use party time when we get to the next enemy. Blood star limb, a severed limb of a blood star easily regenerated by the host creature. Collect three more to increase vitality. That's right, we've read that before. Don't we have two then? Let's say collect three more though. Do we need five? Guess we didn't take that one up, huh? Oh, well, we'll search over here first. We needed that. We need that heart kelp. All right, that looks like a boss arena. So before we go down there, I'd, I want to check up top. We have not checked that yet. Let's go over there. Here we go. Excuse me, guys. Don't mind me at all. Wait, is that a show? No. Party time, baby. Isn't it right here? Yeah. Go see what's up top. It's the only place we haven't checked. All right. 
we need to go up higher though. We don't make that. There's, it looks like a, like a legendary though. All right, we're up here now. Okay. We do get these crystals. These must be super valuable, I'm assuming. We, we have 22 of them. I don't know what they do, but... Okay, now how do we get that legendary? There it is. We just drop off right here. A little flutter just in case. Bark kelp sprout. A piece of kelp ready to bear nutritious pods. Permanently increase the amount of heart kelp pods you can hold. Oh, nice. So now we can hold four. Okay, that's that's hella nice. I'm, I'm glad we got that before this boss fight too. Let's go handle business with our orc. Okay, we can make that. And party time. Whatever party time does, I'm not too sure. But we'll go figure that out. All right, a lot of shells down there, too, if shit gets wild. Do we have stowaways on? Plus 10 defense and plus 2 res. Yeah, let's go with that. Could do plus 3 vitality, though. I don't know. We'll, we'll see how the fight goes. We might swap out. All right, big crab. It is game time. Let's go. Polluted Platoon Pathfinder. Crushing attacks. The blue aggro symbol lets you know an enemy is about to use a crushing attack. These are powerful blows that are very likely to break your shell if you're hiding in it. When you see it, be sure to dodge, run, or jump. Okay, so same thing. Just get it out of the way. GTFO. Oh, which we rolled into that. Okay, so three swings. Party time. Wait, party time did big damage. Wait for the third swing. We go in. Party time. Ow. 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 Ooh, okay. We got to swap out. Oh, that was a crushing blow. That was what we did not want to use in that instance. Okay. He's going to do his three swings. We go in. Okay, we can actually activate this. Pop them with bubbles. Nice big damage with the bubbles. Ow. Bubble attack. Yeah, we hit him with the bubbles. Nice. Oh, oh, shit. There's going to be three. We're out of food, too. No, that crushing blow came so fast. Oh, we almost had him. Okay, we got him. We got him this time, though. We got him this time. I love that this game spawns you at the boss arena. Here we go. Unfortunately, we do not have the party cap. The party cap was kind of really, really good. Honestly, these bubbles, though. There is a lot. We can handle business with the bubbles. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, here we go. Just keep popping them. There we go. Gotta roll that. Roll that and eat. Eat. Oh, shit. Swap out. Love that damage, actually. Ah. 
There we go. Let's pop them. We can go with the charge attack. No, we can't. No, we can't. No, we can't. We died. I was greedy. I was super greedy right there. Damn. I just wanted to do the charge attack and stagger him. It would have killed him. But also, if I just uh, played smart, you know, would have killed him as well. All right, here we go. Third time's a charm, right? Let's go, mister. Okay. Ow. Oh, that crushing blow is big. Oh, I didn't mean to pop into him. We gotta swap shells. Oh, we rolled right into that again. Damn. He's really messing us up. It, it's a little awkward. To, uh... To dodge. The, the roll's a little awkward. Probably because I'm on mouse key. It's probably a little better on controller, but... That's okay. We'll be alright. Alright, here we go. Pop him. I want to use these, like, early so we can... Farm some more now. Get the charge. We got the stagger. Nice. Hit him as much as we can while he's down. We can probably pop him to death, to be honest. I'm stuck on the wall. We got out of that. Nice. Got him. Let's go. Crab defeated. Pristine pearl. A gorgeous pearl manufactured somewhere beyond the ocean. Looks perfect for impressing royalty. Okay, then we can bring that back to the Duchess. What's, uh, what's down here? Moon Snail's Domain. What's up, Moon Snail? That, that thing said we would meet you. Give me those crystals real quick, and then we'll talk. Perfect. At long last, the hermit crab lays eyes on the powerful, borderline, sensual body of the moon snail. Hi. Thanks for leading me here. I think the Duchess is really going to like this pearl. But I still need a way to get out of this cave. In order to progress, the hermit crab will need to further expand on his umami abilities. Cool. How do I do that? I'm getting to it. Damn. I mean, um, <laughs> the hermit crab closes his eyes and allows himself to become one with the waves. He notices the effect his body has on the currents around him and lets himself be changed by them in turn. Okay. Hey, when I close my eyes, I can start to see something. I see a tree, some sort of tree of skills. Ooh, here we go. Skills, baby. So we have five. Oh, so this is what the crystals are for. Ah, ha, ha, I see. Shelleportation allows you to warp between previous visited moon snail shells. Hell yes. Give it to us. I hit E on left. I guess I'll just click. Every single thing leaves currents in its wake as it travels through this ocean. Be it a living person, a beast, a corpse, or even a piece of garbage. The life force of the ocean, the beating heart of this world. This phenomenon is known as umami. Or umami. Whatever it is. Umami? I'm going to say umami because umami, <laughs> you know, it kind of sounds weird, right? Invisible to most, umami currents 
can be detected only by a chosen few. Even fewer skill, or even fewer still, can make use of them. Oh, the glowing purple stuff? I've seen that surrounding some big shells and crystals out there. Surprising. I guess I didn't need to zap you then. I mean, um, the hermit crab's training may progress faster than anticipated. He feels that perhaps if he enters a discarded moon snail shell, a new use for it might reveal itself. Okay. Um, let's go see. It's going to allow us to access the tree, I'm assuming. And we can teleport, of course. Shelleporting, Krill's attunement to Umami will now enable him to warp between any moon snail shells he has previously visited. Acknowledge. Um, first things first, we'll level up. Yeah, let's just go like all into this ability. The MSG, confirm, 20. Yes. All right. Um, let's see. Okay. Do I have to actually be out here to access the skill tree? Yes. You do not have the pre prereqs for the skill. Oh, we probably have, the, probably have to teleport. I just want to make sure we got everything in this little cavern. I think we did. Yeah, we did. Okay, let's teleport back to the Duchess then. Important locations, the Swallows, the Moon Snail's Domain. The Hermit Crab now knows instinctively to return to this place whenever he faces danger beyond his abilities. I will, thank you. While we're at it, can you tell me how taxes work? The Hermit Crab knows instinctively to stop pushing his luck. All right, here we go. All right, we're back here, only because it kind of told us to come back here. Um, we still can't do the skill tree though. All right, let's, I think it just wanted to talk to us like that. Why is it still blinking like it wants a spear? Important locations. Do I need to talk to him more? Maybe. Number card returns prepared to augment his abilities. Learn skills. Oh, okay. We can only learn skills from um, this place. Gotcha. Skewer, press uh, mouse one while sprinting to perform a rapid lunging attack. That would be nice. Streamline, press shift, mid jump to gracefully dodge through the water. That'd be nice too. Parry, release your block the moment an enemy strikes to perform a parry. Your shell won't take damage and your opponent might flinch. Let's go with skewer, I think. Out in the ocean, open ocean, many creatures must take of another's body in order to survive. The hermit crab has taken life many times already. But as his story escalates, so too must the violence. Oh, we don't have enough. So this one's 20. Spear fishing. Press F to throw your fork at enemies to reel them in at the cost of a barbed hook. Be careful. Larger enemies will put up a fight. Uh, I don't really feel like spear fishing. That doesn't sound interesting to me. Hold mouse one in the air to perform a powerful plunging attack down. Now that sounds interesting to me, but that's 25. We need two more crystals. We could go the other route and grab these. Mid jump, a mid jump dodge would be nice. Uh, probably not do anything with pairing. We'll see, we'll save up for plunge, I think. So we get a down attack. Yeah, let's do that one. Skewer. Press that. Yep. Let's see. How does this work? Boom. Boom. Nice. I don't think I can do it while I'm right here. Let's go talk to the Duchess. Why does it still want me here? 
I, I don't think we need to be here right now. Um. Moonstone's cave. Just go to central, right? I think so. We, we need two more gems to do the upgrade that I want to get. Like, out of all of them, I would want to have plunge first. Okay, where's the, where's the big castle? Back here? Back this way? Yeah. Wait, no. Wait, yeah? Is this it? Wait, what happened? What happened to the castle? What? What's going on? I've been standing watch my whole life. For what? Got nothing in return. Stupid, stupid. Hey, excuse me. I gotta get back in to see the Duchess again. It keeps piling up all the trash, all the work. Are you like, okay, man? Sick of it. I'm sick to death of all of it. It's all so worthless. Oh! Yo! There's Skewer in action. Oh, Skewer's hella nice. Come here. Got him. Very nice. Very nice little bubble attack and skewer action right there. Okay. Well, something went down. Here, I think. Port Slack Tide. What's going on, actually? What has happened? I'm gonna go back and talk to the... The, the snail, real quick. I'm a little confused what, what happened. What happened to the Duchess? Maybe I'll supposed to talk to him some more. Let's go see. I mean, it, it did have the marker on there. Like, it wanted us to do something there still, right? It was, like, important location. Let's go find out. Something odd is going on. Something rather odd. Let's talk some more. Generous has ever been... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Back. Oh, we can refund skills? So, like, we can respec? That's nice. Um, let's exit. Okay, there's nothing to do here, then. I think it's just saying because I have enough to get something. Um, that's why it's marked on the map. But, okay, something weird is going on. At the castle, the Duchess seems to be gone and it seems to be infested with bad creatures, bad crabs, and bad fish, bad sea animals that we'll have to kill. And we will do that in the next run through of the game. I think I'm going to end this one here. This I'm, I'm really enjoying this game. This is fun. This is a fun little take for a Souls-like game. I like this. You know, the ocean is pretty scary and pretty eerie, at least in real life, in my opinion. One of my biggest fears, being trapped out there. No, you know, just by yourself. Nothing, just floating in the ocean. Like, ooh. Ooh, man, how horrifying would that be? How horrifying would that be? Anyways, this game does a good job at not making the ocean seem scary. And it's a very cute game. I'm enjoying it a lot. We're playing as Krill the Crab here, trying to get our shell back. And we have the pearl for the Duchess, but she's gone. So we're going to have to figure out where the hell she's at in the next run of the game. But anyways, thanks for watching this one, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.